Hi, this is Richard Byrne at freetech4teachers.com. In this video, we're going to take a look at how to create an online picture book using Jelly Bean Writer, which is a part of the Jelly Bean Scoop website. Now, for teachers, I want to point out that once you're signed into your account, you can create and manage your own student accounts. I'm here in my teacher account. You can see here that I can have up to 25 students in my free account. And I can go in and now add a student. Let's add Morrison as a student. We'll give him a password. And we can give him a little avatar if we want to. Let's, uh, give him the, let's give him the monkey. There we go. And now add him. Great. And so now Morrison has an account. And that's a, a great feature of any site when you can manage your student accounts so if they forget their passwords they can you can go back in and uh, change those for them. Now let's go over to Jelly Bean Writer. Let's create a book and it's going to open a new tab. Alright and so now we're into the Jelly Bean Writer interface and you can see we have a whole bunch of templates that we can pick from over here on the left hand side. You can use just a picture, you could use multiple pictures with various blocks of font and all kinds of configurations here. This is going to be my title page. So let's go ahead and add a picture from my computer. And I'll add a picture of one of my dogs. And we'll just call this one a story about my dogs. Now let's go on to our next page. And here we can put in a different format if we want to. So just click and drag that over. Now we have a new format. And we can add in some more pictures. Let's go ahead and add in this picture here. And we'll add in another picture. Now we can write some captions. We'll say the dog with the stick is named Max. Max loves to swim. The dog in the snow is named Morrison. He loves the cold weather. Now, as you can see, we can re repeat this process over and over again until we're content with what we have. Now, we can also, at any point, just save the pre the project, and we'll just call it "My Dogs." So now it's saved in my account and let's say we're done with the project we can go ahead and download it here or we can print it out. And we'll just call it my dogs. And it'll save as a PDF and I'm going to save it to my desktop. So that's how you can create a picture book story using a Jelly Bean Writer. And for more tips and tricks like this, check out freetech4teachers.com.